everyone, Imagination here and welcome to my channel. Today, we are going to make a Harry Potter wand. Here are the materials that we need. Chopsticks, hardening clay, or you can also use polymer clay or epoxy putty, some clay tools, sandpaper, cutter, paper clip and hairpin, water and rag, this one is optional, paint, paintbrush, and mud budge. Now, let's get started. Now, let's get our chopstick. This one measures approximately nine and a half inches. You can also use a bigger size of chopstick so that you can have the actual size of the one that you want. But for this video, I'm just going to use smaller chopstick because it's the most common and it's easier to find. I'm just sanding it a little so that later the paint will stick better. I just divided the chopstick into three parts. The middle measures around 2 inches, that is 4 inches from the bottom. Now I'm taking my hardening clay, I'm just kneading it a little. After that, you're just going to cover the middle part of your chopstick. Now I'm just taking some water and apply it to the clay so that it will be smoother. You can use a pencil holder if you need to set aside your unfinished one. And of course, we need to use our rag to clean our hand. If you can see, it's not even. So what we need to do is to get a small amount of clay to fill that in. And then smoothen it out. I actually have my desired measurements of wands here in my notebook. Now let's make the handle of the wand. Here, I'm just smoothing it out. Now I'm just getting my clay tool to mold the clay better. The handle of the real wand looks like it's hewn from a tree. But for me, I want to smooth it out because it's easier for me that way. It's really up to your preference.
Now I'm just cutting the bottom of the middle part of our wand into a V-shape using our cutter. This time, I'm getting this flat clay tool to even out the cut. Now we are going to make some holes in our wand using our hair clip and hair pin. However, the clay is still too wet so we need to wait to make it a little dry. And since it's already evening, so I'll get back to you tomorrow. Good night! Okay, good morning! And I'm back! I actually oversleep for 12 hours, so I hope we can still make holes on this wand. You can also see some cracks in our wand, but no worries, we'll do something about that later on. I'm just making some scratches in the middle of the handle to look as if our wand was hewn from a tree. To make the whole size different, I'm alternately using hairpin and paper clip. Now I'm making the buds of our wand. And of course, we need to smoothen it out, just like this. To make the complete look of our buds, we are going to make a hole out of it. And of course, for the cracks, we need to take a small amount of clay to fill that in. Now it's time to paint! For the middle part, we'll be using acrylic paint in raw umber. For the handle, we are going to use color black. Make sure you completely paint the holes. And of course, for the bottom, we are going to paint it with brown.
we are almost done and for the last step we are going to apply our Mod Podge. This will serve as the seal. And we are done! Here I just want to show you that I also made a Harry Potter wand out of the bigger chopstick. And of course if you want to see more of wand tutorials and other DIYs, don't forget to comment and subscribe to my channel. We'll see you again! Bye!